Now this is spruce, which gets a lot of knots in it. And normally we carve with cedar. Hey, my name is Pete Shoko. We're in the Drumheller Institution, which is a federal penitentiary. And what I'm doing here is I'm carving a watchman, which is a figure that uh, would be generally put in a high area where he can warn uh, the height of, of incoming danger, ships and what have you. But to this point, I think it's taken me close to a month to get it just shaped out like this. And uh, it took me about another month to finish it off. Yeah, uh, it's a very relaxing thing. It's, uh, it comes from in, inside you. Like, uh, I, do, I don't draw things out too much. I sort of visualize what it should look like with these sticks here. See, I just sort of start carving and uh, it's in my head what it should be. This is a, a walking stick and, and then this one here is a talking stick. The difference is a talking stick is when you're in a meeting, uh, whoever has the stick does the talking type of thing. I guess it's like the British Mace in Parliament. You bring that in, the meeting starts. But I just generally envision something like this as a killer whale, a wolf, buffalo, an eye, everything eye, a beaver buried in a fish and an eagle. I, I get lost in carving. It's, um, I'm not in jail when I'm doing that. Freedom. <laughs> yeah, it's like you're free because you, 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 know, you, you use your mind to do what you're doing. And, kind of a good thing. They should have more carving. Uh, we used to have a hobby shop here and I guess we're getting another one opened up here pretty quick and I think that's a good thing because it's good therapy for a lot of people to uh, to uh, work with their hands and uh, get into hobbies, uh, carving or leather work or something like that. You know, it passes the time and you sort of for that minute or two what you're doing, you're lost in it and uh, you're not in jail.